Hello, hello, Dr. Cliff, your movement recovery specialist, and welcome back to Breakfast at the Office. Today is day number one of season three. And as promised, we're having a special short season of Siggy's yogurt products. Most of them are yogurts. There's a couple other things thrown in there that they make as well. It's not really sponsored by Siggy's, but they enjoyed my videos on yogurt about their uh, products last month. And they sent me a big stack of coupons. So we're using those coupons to try out more of their yogurts. Today we're going to have a full fat mixed berry yogurt. This is one of these kind of low profile containers. Like, uh, I think we had a vanilla one like this last month. Just looks like this on the top, fairly plain. And has a picture of some strawberries and raspberries and blackberries, I guess, on the side. Um, I got this one at Publix. The majority of these I got at Whole Foods because Whole Foods carries a big stack of Siggy's products. But They've spread out as far as a uh, corporation, and you can get them at a lot of other grocery stores as well. You can even order some of these on Amazon, uh, since they own Whole Foods now. But I find it's a little expensive to order yogurt through uh, Amazon, just because of probably the weight. You know, I don't know why, but it must just be more complicated shipping, since it's a cold and fairly heavy product. Not going to find too many prime deals, I don't think. Just go to the store. I'll put some links down there if you really, you know, want something and you can't find it otherwise, but probably just go to the store. Uh, it cost me a dollar sixty-seven, And here's the numbers. Protein, 12 grams. Carbs, 11 grams. Fat, 4.5 grams. Calories, 130, and I believe this is a slightly different size, yes, 4.4 ounces. Not a lot of ingredients, that's always a good sign, right? Whole milk, cream, sugar cane, a stack of fruit. I think that's it. Oh, look, I got another coupon on the inside. Save a dollar on any two. I might have to keep that. Nice and thick. Doesn't smell super fruity. This isn't one of these like fruit on the bottom deals. Just has a lot of fruit flavor mixed in theoretically. Let's see. This is definitely one of these hang out on the spoon yogurts, right? Nice and thick. So you can tell it's that full fat yogurt. It really fills up your mouth. Just kind of coats everything. It's good. It's not great. Um, I've had a Siggy strawberry by itself. You can taste the strawberry more. I think when they throw a bunch of different fruits in like this, just kind of mute each other. Oh my goodness, I don't have my coffee. It's still in the other room. Well, you're going to have to fix that. Hold on momentarily. Okay, back with coffee. Have to edit part of that out. Ah, much better. So, where was that? Oh, taste. Taste, um, I'm going to grade a little harsher this uh, season because everything's a Siggy. So I can't just give everything a 7 to a 10, right? So, 
because I can't really separate out the berries, I'm going to give it a five. Last month, this would have been a six or maybe a seven. But because we're grading all these Siggies in each other, this is just average for Siggies. Five. If you like this video and you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing. It's that red button down here in the corner. If you're already subscribed, thank you for coming back. We have uh, about two weeks of Siggy's yogurts. Then we're moving on to coffee. Ha <laughs> ha. Which I have a giant stack of coffee that fills up half the refrigerator right now. So, until tomorrow, remember, life is a strength sport, so get stronger and get living.